There's a project folder on my hard drive labeled Perfectionism. Here's some clips from it. Now here's a clip from my first ever YouTube video. I think, I think I'm good. Okay. So. I've honestly tried to make this video a few times. I started and I stop. I started again either because uh, I get bored of it, uh, another project takes my interest, I get lazy, or, or I just feel like there's no story to what it is I'm filming. Then I just tell myself, you know, that's, you're just practicing, it's all practice, and it'll be used for something later. That's a cycle I fall into a lot, and I'm probably not the only person. I've been trying for the past few years to uh, break bad habits and start good ones trying and failing on multiple occasions, but trying nonetheless. I'd have multiple day ones and new projects, new ideas, some that I don't finish and some you just never see. You've honestly probably heard it a million different times from a million different places in a million different ways, but I honestly truly believe that it's, it's way better to like try and fail than it is to not try at all. And that's something that I've learned from trying and failing and then, you know, just jumping straight back on the horse and trying to get back at it. Whether that be for a project that I, I take way too long to finish musically or a YouTube video that I shoot a million different times in a million different locations and never actually put out. I've wanted to start making YouTube videos again for a while now, but I get I just so caught up in like what, what the video should be about, what angles I should use, what lighting techniques I should use. Um, but that's all, it doesn't make a difference, honestly, I don't think. Um, obviously, I, I want to show my improvement over the years. Sometimes I suffer from a nasty case of uh, analysis paralysis. Too many options, too many ways to do things, so I just don't do them at all. This bare-faced motherfucker shot this video on a whim in an old camera and edited it in a 24-hour computer lab. He then proceeded to put out video after video for about four years. I've been overthinking it, so I think that it's time to get back to it. Yeah. <laughs>